Let's go over the solution to weekly math challenge number 9 and this time we have a winner and it is Will Secker. 2 thirds times the square root of 481 is precisely the right answer. A big shout out to him for figuring this question out. So let's go over this question. Triangle ABC has side lengths 40, 41 and 9 and one of the first things to realize is that this triangle is a right triangle because 40, 41, and 9 are Pythagorean and triple. So this is a right triangle. 40 squared plus 9 squared gets you 41 squared. You guys can check it out if you want to. So we have a triangle that looks something like this. We have, it's a right triangle, and we have legs of 9 and 40, and a hypotenuse of 41. And we know D is on BC, so let me label the sides first. So we know AC is 9. A, B is 40 and, A, and B, C is 41. That looks like it. And we want to plot D on B, C such that A, D bisects B, C. So you're bisecting it. And this is one of the theorems. If if a, me, if a segment drawn from the, the right angle to the midpoint of the hypotenuse is drawn, then this median is one half the length of the hypotenuse. And that's not a very well-known fact, but you guys, you guys can prove it. And I, I may make a video in the future proving this, but this, the length of this segment AD is precisely equal to one half the, one half the hypotenuse or 41 over two. So AD is 41 over two. I may make a video in the future proving this, but for now, trust me that AD is one half of BC and we have we have, well, what else do we have? We have uh, G is on AB and the intersection of CG and AD is F. So we have point G on AB. Let me actually bring that closer to this side as we're about to find out. And the intersection of CG and AD is F. And we know AF is 41 over 3. And realize 41 over 3 is equal to 2 thirds of AD. If you have 41 over 2 multiply by 2 thirds, you get 41 over 3. And since that's telling you AF and FD are in ratio 1 to 2, because AF is 2 thirds of the entire thing, uh, FD has to be 1 third of the entire thing, so the ratio is 1 to 2. And that's telling you, that's telling you F is centroid. It is the intersection or the point of concurrency of the medians of the triangle. And since CG starts from the vertex and goes through the centroid, you know, you know CG is also a median, so you know this, you know you can divide this as 20 and 20. So what do we want to find? We want to find a CF. And to find the CF, CF is simply going to be, since you're going from vertex to centroid, and centroid divides the, the median in 2 to 1 ratio, the, our answer is going to be two thirds of CG. So if we can find CG, we are done. And to find CG, we can focus on we can focus on this triangle, this right triangle, and we have the length twenty nine, and we have CG, and that's telling us CG is equal to square root of twenty squared plus nine squared, also known as square root of four eighty one. So so our final answer is two thirds times square root of 481.